today is a very special day. We're going camping. We're gonna see if we survive in the wilderness. How to stay on track on your diet when you're out in the woods. Jennifer is packing a bunch of things here. So we got food. We're also packing all the important things here. Snacks, thermoses for coffee and tea, bars, more bars, and we're also getting a bunch of meat. We haven't put that in yet. We're gonna have bison and turkey. And so what do you think, Genevieve? Are we gonna make it through? Will we come back home? <laughs> yes. <laughs> the journey has begun. We are on our way to... I don't even know where. We're gonna try to survive and see what happens, I guess. Try to survive. Cars packed. Everything. We got everything we need. <laughs> Including a tire. We're gonna teach you guys and show you how to survive in the woods and get all your macros in. <laughs> and cook your food with an open fire and maybe hunt your own food. We'll see what happens. <laughs> Let the games begin. We also, in case of emergency. In case it gets cold. We brought <laughs> wine in case it gets cold. It's supposed to be like 40 something degrees tonight, I think. Yeah. And it's actually really cold outside there of the hats. And I'm um, freezing and sh I don't know if she's freezing, but it is pretty cold. So let's see how this goes. How Swedish turned Floridian and now gonna go sleep in the forest where it's freezing. And you guys know I hate cold because I say that all the time. But I'm doing it because I like a challenge. Of course I put whipped cream on that. Anything else I get for you? That's old, thank you. Wait, oh, what did you put on you? it? Whipped cream. Whipped cream? Sweet. But no flavor. But no flavor, okay. No flavor, heard that. We're getting coffee for the drive. One hour drive, we bought a bunch of stuff. Fishing stuff, uh, wood for the fire. What else did we buy? Oh, the most important thing is cups for the wine. <laughs> <laughs> Not that we needed them. <laughs> no, they were just cute. And yeah, lots of fun shit. We're not going catfishing. That's for sure. We're not going to. Basie. You got a pumpkin on it. That's a fun looking cup. I've never seen red cups before. A scooters. Scooters. Mm -hmm. Never heard of. Again, snack time. More. Nom, nom, nom. Yes. My husband spot, might be in the system. But now we're hungry. So we're in this camping spot and we realized that in some places there are a lot of people. So if we lived back in the days, then we and I would have been the witches that Some lived alone. Yes. And far, far away from all the other people. And everyone thought we were witches because we did weird things that nobody else does. Like Close we enough. eat a lot of food and we lift things. And we look different from everyone else and we don't want to be close to any other people or society. So basically, we're witches. witches. We're witches. witches, witches. So, we found our new home. This is where the, the queen witches are gonna live now. Want bring one thing over there, yes. <laughs> nice. The most important thing of all, the, <laughs> the coffee, the kitchen. <laughs> this is the most important thing of all, after the kitchen, because this is how we're gonna catch our food. <laughs> Probably. The kayak. <laughs> house is almost done. Super fancy, huh? New house. 
camp has been set up and I'm gonna give you guys a little tour of camp. What do we call it? Mad camp. Mad camp. House is ready. In the house we got speaker, we got the snack corner and all of those goodies. Oatmeal, snacks, we got our wine and our new wine cups. And obviously, we got our food box ready to eat because we're hungry. And then we have our little house. Uh, Jen, you should have been the tour guide. <laughs> We forgot the stuffed animals, but it looks pretty fancy. So this is a four and a half star hotel. The only thing missing for the fifth star there is room service. We do not have that. Yet. That's the only thing, <laughs> yet. So what are we doing over here? I'm getting us uh, our fishing rods ready. Yeah. Hunting our food. <laughs> It's probably time for coffee soon too, I think. Right. And also, you know, when you live out in the woods, never to forget color flame. So we can have flames in whatever color we wish. Do you have alligators here in Kansas? I don't know. Maybe next time we go camping in Florida. Yeah. Try to catch an alligator. We were supposed to kayak, but uh, we were loose. We lost. We were missing a piece of thing to get the kayak up because it's like an, uh, a kayak that you in, put air in basically. So no kayaking, but we're gonna be hiking and fishing instead. We have a slight problem. So we bought these at Walmart and they literally, we didn't even, I mean, who would even think about looking if they have a handle, so they came with a handle, so we can't actually fish now. So Walmart, you kind of suck. Uh, so I guess we're just gonna make some food on the fire and then go hiking. So no kayaking and no fishing. <laughs> we're gonna have a very strange checklist of things to check before we go camping next time. Things you wouldn't really think you would have to check, but hey, you're learning. I can't say that I go camping very often. I can't say that I go camping ever, actually. I have camped when I was young, but it's been a hot minute. The weather is fantastic, and we actually, <laughs> we're, we're not gonna go there, but there are actually toilets over there that we're not gonna use, because we're doing the real deal here. But we parked here, and then it's like, oh, there's a tiny little house over there <laughs> with toilets and and the pump I think the we're starting a stick hunt for the fire. I I don't know what she's doing over there because we're out in the wilderness nowhere and she's on, on something that looks like a phone. And I'm on something that looks like a camera, but we're pretending that's not here because uh, otherwise I wouldn't be able to show you guys this. But the service, we're not supposed to have any service. <laughs> Okay, Genevieve, I got a pee, so where's the toilet? Where do we make a toilet? What did you say? Where are we making the toilet? I got a pee. Oh, I just peed next to the truck. Oh, you did? Oh, you already started? I thought we were gonna make a dedicated toilet spot here. Okay, I gotta go pee. Size do matter. I will. At least that's what she says. <laughs> she tells me my sticks are not big enough. Are we gonna put the whole place on fire? <laughs> okay, fire's about to start. Guys, watch carefully and learn how to make a fire. I thought we were gonna like be using two sticks here and do it the old school way. Yeah, we are using two sticks, one and two. <laughs> <laughs> but you know that we like uh, spinning a stick real fast uh, until the fire starts. And are we putting color on this too? Yeah. Yeah, Maybe I need some of that now. shit because I'm bitten sure. already. 
And the coffee pot. Oh, this is so pretty. Has the cover right there. This is actually very pretty. I love that. And then we also brought sticks from Walmart. <laughs> oh my god, yes. Next time we're camping, we're doing it in South Africa. With the leopards and the elephant. Oh! Okay, please tell the camera about the leopard you told me before. Oh, so we were not camping, but we were sleeping outside on an open deck and you could hear the leopard breathing while I was walking under like where our arms hanged off the deck. Do you think he sniffed you a little bit while you slept? Did I you sleep not. at all? No, okay. I didn't. I almost shut my pants. And then you saw you saw the <laughs> paw, paw marks, right? Yeah, and then we saw its paw prints the next morning. Like literally That's crazy. here. It sounds crazy and I kind of want to do it. It's amazing. We're going to do it. Yeah. What do you have there? Hold on. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> she got the memo yeah, that size about. matters. Yep. <laughs> Max uh, bringing us a whole tree <laughs> because our firewood is burning a lot quicker than we would like. Okay, there. See what we got down here. We need more firewood. I then found something that might help right. us survive the night. So pretty. Let's see what's going on. I doubt we'll get it. on our faces. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> One. Two. No, I mean, what if we kick it with our feet? I think it's easier to push it over. Oh, what if we pull it? Huh? <laughs> Leg press. Oh, it will come. Okay, it looked like I was doing good, but I think we have one zero Genevieve as of now, but the games continue. Okay, we're going to go for a little walk. And uh, as we said, we are hunting and all of our food. So we just went for a hunt and we both catch the sevia. <laughs> so we're <Lucky> enjoy <laughs> enjoying this on the walk. And check this out. It's very stony and rocky. Genevieve says that she usually do this barefoot. Right? Yep. And I guess we could. But right now we're rocking the hiking boots from Y3. Nike. Nike. <laughs> See what we find. And the, it's actually not cold. It's less cold here than it was closer to the city, which is kind of weird. Can you click the button? Mm -hmm. He's definitely fish. Yeah. Hand fishing. I mean, That's what we need to do. We can throw it in and mm -hmm. just reel the line in with our hands. We can try that in a minute. Yeah. Let's give it a shot. Are we swimming? 
Do you want to? Yes. Wait, in what? Naked? Yes. Okay. When it's dark. Okay, let's do. <laughs> okay. I found Max's first Yay. meal. Mm hmm. Nice catfish. So I just bowl. like chew on it, kind of? Yeah. Mmm. You can smell it. it. Smells like catfish. Out there, we're gonna have our morning coffee and watch the sunset. Sunrise. Sunrise, I mean. <laughs> What's that? Just a little itchy. <laughs> Trying to post. We have no service. <laughs> We get some steak, onion, mushroom, cheese, rice, and of course, Valentina sauce. Most important. Okay, we're gonna cook here now. And we're cleaning it with and what? An onion? Yep. Why? Because we don't have anything else to clean with. <laughs> This is the South African jungle queen right here. She got a solution for almost everything except the fishing handle. That was yeah. the only thing she could not resolve. Deliciousness. Size matters, as you guys see, even when it comes to mushrooms. <laughs> And some gluten-free pizza crackers. Also have the food scale with us. Obviously. It's starting to get a little chilly, but it's nice here by the fire. I have not, I'm gonna be honest, I have not gone camping in a very, very, very long time. Never used to like it, but I used to be a scout when I was young. But the only thing I don't mind being in the forest and stuff like that. I wanted to join the military when I was younger and I did a, a bunch of these things where they take girls out in the woods and you have to pre you pretend you're a military basically <laughs> to try it out. But when I was little, I was a scout and I always told my mom, like sometimes I would refuse to go out and my teacher had to call and like, you have to come pick her up. She refused, like she won't go anywhere. And my mom would be like, why do you not want to do this? And I'd be like, they make us pee. <laughs> look at that steak. That's how it should look. Rice. Some smoky stick going on over there. Mm -hmm. And I don't know about you guys, but I like my red wine kind of warm because it tastes better. And we get some fancy cups too, that glows in the dark. That's what we're gonna use when it gets pitch black outside. We use the cup to find our way. Right. So if I was out here alone, I'd probably be fine. But with Genevieve with me, I'm even finer. Slowly but surely get in there. And it's looking nice, very bloody on the inside. You're leaking uh, ash right now. She's <laughs> turning into a piece of coal. <laughs> turning into pot. Food is almost done. And of course, we're gonna weigh everything out. <laughs> just kidding, fuck that shit. We're just gonna eat. We're short on meals and it's getting late. We have some catching up to do. So we're just gonna eat everything we brought, I think. Food, snacks, all of it. Steaks are done, looking nice and juicy. They probably cooked a little different, so we would do like a half and half here. Mm -hmm. so we get different cuts. Fat. Oh, she likes the fat. You take all the fat, that's fine. <laughs> and the mushrooms are looking nice. Onion, mmm, nom nom. And crispy rice, my favorite thing. Get some 
some real knives here. So, oh wait, you need a knife. I'm yeah. an idiot. Okay, maybe. <laughs> knife and a fork. So, just cut it on here. Oh, you just cut it on there, obviously. See how that looks. It's fantastic. No, it's Oh, it's very cut, but it's a little bloody in the middle. But hey, we're we're, we're not uh, we're not staking the wild per experts yet. Yet, I say yet. It's so bloody there, though. I think it's great. Honestly, how's that one? What does it say? Still mm. bloody. And crispy. Oh, jeebus. I think we're gonna get spoiled, and this is all we're gonna be able to eat now. So the onion too. That one shrunk into nothingness. This is a real dinner. We forgot salt and pepper, but luckily we had Valentina sauce, who does that does have a bunch of sodium. So we're all good on that. Don't forget the sodium, guys. It's still juicy so, steak. Juicy, juicy, look at this shit. See how we're eating the exact same food? No matter if we're out in the wilderness, cooking on a fire, or if we're at home. Mm -hmm. Same meal, like you said, same meal, different location. Okay. The big guy is on. I'm gonna try not to set the whole place on fire. There we go. <clears throat> Music time. Got these cute chairs here. We like this old matching couple. We got matching shirts too. Mm -hmm. This food was so good. Here's the deal guys, if somebody wants to go on a date with me, this is what we're doing. We're going out, camping, cooking our food on a fire, show me what you got. Oh, I don't know if we're going to get this one. Is the wine warm? The bottle is warm. Good. I kind of don't want to use my teeth though. I'm gonna bite it off. <laughs> I'm literally gonna bite it off. My seesaw is sinking in. We found this opener here in the wilderness. <laughs> this is what they used to use back in on this in this, uh, the Stone Age. <laughs> it's not even. <laughs> this is what a $4.99 <laughs> wine opener does for you. <laughs> it's <laughs> it's great. <laughs> it's not even fucking moving. Oh, there we go. Come on, arms. We're probably the. <laughs> Do you see? It's just like coming up without the actual cork in it. That's crazy. See the arms come up. Huh? We got the arms. And then, oh, <gasps> it's working. Okay, I'm just gonna have to take it slow, but it's working. Should we take the glow in the dark sticker off of this? No, no I like that. <laughs> the glow in the dark sticker. That's kind of like the whole point. Because <laughs> later at night when we get lost, this is what's gonna take us back home. Bye, bottle.
Wait, fuck. Max? Max? Fuck. I'm just gonna... Oh my god. Genevieve! Where are you? Oh my god. Wait, why is this still recording? Okay, we're about to make some marshmallows and chocolate on the fire. This is like we got cracker. Oh wait, can I eat the cracker? It's no. a graham cracker. Oh no, I can't do that. No. Just chocolate and marshmallows. I was like, <laughs> I mean, you can use a pizza cracker. Oh, pizza cracker, yeah. I guess I can try. We got a sink pizza cracker with is it gluten free? I mean I'm gonna try. That's a thing like that. Yeah, that's a that's a thing. That is crazy. She lies pretty good from a distance. Mm. On this uh, s'mores deal. So we have popcorn. It's stuck in there. So this is the gluten free version. Whatever. Mm. Cheese popcorn <laughs> with um, marshmallow and chocolate. It's actually pretty good. I like them. Mm -hmm. I made them the other I'm day. Doing another one. Mm. It was pretty good, but cheese popcorn and the whole marshmallow deal here. Yeah. I'm just twinsies. <laughs> We're twinsies. Nom, nom. My face is on fire. <laughs> oh. Oh. Mm. It's so realistic. You know, I love my popcorners and I eat them in all different ways. On s'mores, they were perfect. Now I'm gonna try just hot, hot popcorn. They're also delicious, dipped in uh, nut butter. I think this might be a hit. So, this is a cheese flavored popcorn. Fantastic. What are you eating? Um, pop popcorner. Corner. Should I dip it in wine? Oh, oh, please, please dip. Popcorn dipped in wine. Cheese flavor dipped in red wine. How is that? Like cheese and wine. Really? Okay, I'm curious about this one. Okay. We have another variation. Valentina sauce with cheddar. It's cheddar, right? Cheddar yeah, popcorn. white cheddar. My cheddar popcorn. How's that one? Better than or worse than the wine? Better. Better than the wine? Better than the wine. Damn. Now, we're rolling. So in South Africa, we obviously have fires all the time and we uh -huh. cook on fire. Sorry, I didn't put the light on. But... Mm -hmm. As kids, our parents tell us if we play with the fire, we'll pee in the bed to try and deter us from playing. So, did you ever play with the fire in South Africa? Yes. Did you pee in the bed? No. No. So you knew they were lying. Yes. Okay. <laughs> but but. they still said it. And what your parents tell you is the truth always. Oh, of course. 
so we never played with fire when they can see. <laughs> What's the thing with Santa Claus over there? Do you have a thing? Um, I'm gonna tell you a story about Santa we Claus. We have a Santa Claus, or at least we do celebrate Christmas, but it's obviously in summer. Yeah. And Santa Claus was usually our uncle <laughs> that yeah. dressed up in a suit. Mm. And he would disappear from the Christmas party and we'd uh -huh. never know where he was. Oh, it was and my grandpa or somebody and they would go buy the newspaper. Yes, yeah, something yeah. like some mm -hmm. story as yeah. to why they're not there. Uh -huh. And the one year we figured it out because Santa had the same socks and shoes as my uncle. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, I have, I'm going to tell everybody. So. I don't know what is it. So I don't know this word in English. You know, when, when you're a kid, you suck on these little pacifier. Pacifier. Yeah, I don't know it. So or my sis, my sister had a thumb, and I had the pacifier, and this was the whole deal. When I turned, I'm gonna say it was three. When I turned three years old, and I had already known this because my mom told me this a long time in advance. When I turned three, because I'm a, my birthday is uh, in December, I had to give my pacifier to Santa, Santa Claus. Claus. Uh, that was just that was just how that was just what you had to do like eh, all the kids did this you know <laughs> so when I was three I had to take all my pacifiers and put them in the bag or something and give them to Santa Claus and that was the end of it so after that I never used them but my sister though she had her thumb which she would be sucking you know for I don't know how many years because clearly you can give your thumb to the Santa Claus but that's a thing we had in my family <laughs> that is hilarious so I stopped at three years old. <laughs> so, did With that. you guys have a tooth fairy or tooth mouse? Uh, I think tooth fairy. So, whenever you lost a tooth, uh, you had to put it in a glass of water next to your bed. Really? I know that some people put it under the pillow, but my mom was clearly smarter enough than to know that she has to stick her hand under my pillow when I'm sleeping. So our thing was we took the teeth and put it in a glass of water next to the bed and do it during... Actually, I don't know if we had a tooth fairy. I think somehow that the tooth turned into money in the water in the glass. I think that's what it was actually. So we had a tooth mouse. Tooth mouse, I've never yes. heard of that. Mm -hmm. And I recently found out that in Mexico they have a tooth mouse too, yeah, and not a fairy. But mm -hmm. we had to put our teeth in a shoe on the oh. floor next to our bed uh -huh. because the mouse won't climb onto your bed, but it will climb into your it's shoe. It's just like a thing. Do you think that that was your family thinking that, or that was just like South Africa? It's in general, in, general in South Africa. I'm yeah. wondering if this tooth in the water shoe is just, just your my mom. mom's <laughs> invention. <laughs> Or if other people do this, I don't know because I have never asked another Swedish person. I was gonna person. say you'll have to go find out in Sweden when you're Seriously, there. Seriously, I think it was just my mom was very clever. She that had a lot smart, of smart ideas. No, I know in general it was a tooth mouse, and you always put your teeth in a shoe. Mm. This is when we we should be telling ghost stories. <laughs> we talk about <laughs> we do the Brandon the happy has. stories instead. Yeah. <laughs> Making s'mores. <laughs> One chocolate down, two chocolate down. <laughs> I'm so sad. It's here. No sugar, alcohol flavored with honey. Sounds horrible. Mochi, some uh, marshmallow, because I don't have anything else. So we're gonna do this. Oh, really good. Problem good or good good? Very good. Like very very good. <laughs> okay, now we can video. Yeah, marshmallow. And then we tried the Mucci. We gotta try with this. We have popcorners. We have everything. Marshmallow with everything. So bright. Marshmallow. Everything works. With marshmallow. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. This is a s'more. I'm gonna make a s'more s'more sandwich. So I'm gonna use a s'more protein s'more. Mm -hmm. With s'more. With a s'more. I wonder if I should taste this first. Probably tastes like butthole. 
Tastes like what? Like butthole. Butthole. <laughs> that bad? Yeah. I'm sure it's good with the marshmallow though. No. I don't think anything can make that taste good. No? No. Yeah, it's that bad. Give me a tiny piece of that. Butthole. It's more like a dirty butthole. Oh, holy shit, you're right. <laughs> it's like a dirty it's butthole. A dirty butthole. Okay, whoever made that protein <laughs> bar, shame on you. <laughs> that was like, I I didn't even expect it to be that bad. Outright too. s'mores tastes like a sandy, dirty oh, you, butthole. Yeah. I, that was probably the best explanation. <laughs> or most on point explanation I've ever heard. I don't it know. Was, I've never tried yeah. butthole, but I imagine that's what it tastes like. Yeah. I don't even want to. It was interesting. I yeah. don't want to ruin the rest of this marshmallow, mm. but I have. Maybe to. the whole marshmallow or a tiny piece just for the texture. Yeah. What about that? <sighs> I'm pretty full. Me too. And no chocolate? No, because chocolate doesn't deserve to be. <laughs> Okay, let's see how that is. Hot. Hot. Wait, what is that little thing left on the stick right now? The marshmallow inside. I never managed to do that. Oh, I got the whole thing off. I just bit it off though. It just makes the marshmallow taste like sand. Oh. It's that bad. Okay, that's absolutely horrible. Do you know what I think could save it? Chocolate? A shit ton of nut butter. Do you think that could save it? Eating? No, maybe. No. Mm, okay. That doesn't oh, happen. Are you still eating it? Are you still eating it? I know, it's horrible. Yeah, it went on the fire. That's how bad it was. It was pretty damn bad. Okay. Oh, yeah. I mochi. Okay, marshmallow. Chocolate. <laughs> um, it's so bright. Mochi. Crispy, creamy. Mm -hmm. Is it fireworks? Do you hear it? It's fireworks. It's for us. Work. So can't fast the pop cup corner turn into literally nothing. Well that fucker from Quest is like surviving. <laughs> this is interesting. So if we do this again, we'll bring more of these treats than that. <laughs> that will last longer in the world. And that was pizza pizza crackers, right? Mm-hmm. Mm -mm. What else can we call? There's a mochi. Oh, oh mochi. How's that one do? What else do we got here? Oh, I have no idea. It's like trash in the fire here. Uh, the whole bag. Oh, that's our trash bag. Okay, whatever. We don't need. We're just burning everything. Genevieve, I'm gonna throw you on the fire. What about your shoes? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> We need to make here fire we so we can put the color stuff on. Oh, yeah. We do. There we go. Your wine should be warm. Oh yeah, you're right. Yeah, let's get some of those. Oh wait, we got more sticks for the fire here. A bunch more, I think. This is how we're gonna survive tonight. We're just throwing everything we find on the fire. I'm pretty sure it's dangerous. dangerous. It does. Huh? This container, do we need it? We got more marshmallows. How are these cold? Now it's good. Holy oh, shit. Okay. Uh, now it's big. The wine's warm now. Mm -hmm. Oh, it okay. says, um, do not open. Oh, did I throw the whole thing in? Yeah, you do. Actually, 
It looks cool, but oh, yeah, not as colorful as uh, it actually is. Got his warm wine. It's Finally, smoking. we got a warm wine. <laughs> you see the smoke? This is what oh, we were aiming so for. Good. If you drink your red wine cold, we can't be friends. We're not friends. I'll tell you that. This is the shit right here. <laughs> it's so smoky. But it's so good. The outright okay. s'mores. So the taste. last one, you had the outright butthole flavor. Yes. So what are we doing now? Apparently this is cookie dough. Apparently it's cookie dough. But, but we'll name it afterwards. Yes. If I can open it. <laughs> We definitely will tag them in this video. <laughs> Step up your game outright. So it looks, went on the fire. <laughs> looks similar to the previous one. Texture feels the same. A butthole texture. Mm -hmm. What is... Uh, has mm -hmm. a very sandy taste. Yeah. What is? What are the ingredients? What is it that makes it sandy? Give me a Itty bitty little munch. You piece. tell me if it tastes like sand okay. as well. Okay, this one is slightly better than the other slightly one. Slightly better. It tastes like peanut butter. That's what it does. Because it's cookie dough. Okay. It tastes like straight peanut butter, literally. But on the dry side. You know when you buy peanut butter? That's and old. If you're not if you don't stir your peanut butter and the oil it's like on top and you eat that first and then when it's been sitting for a while and there's only the dry section of the peanut butter left at the bottom. That's what it tastes like. Like crusty peanut butter? Crusty peanut butter, yeah. So... But the other one was way worse. That was super sandy. This one is just like half So it's sandy. like... Crusty butthole if you put the two together. <laughs> crusty butthole. <laughs> I think that we both can agree that the first form bars are better. <laughs> this is what we think of outright bars. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> Sleepy time. Oh, I forgot to do my injection. <laughs> Valentina is in here. Okay, I'll do it tomorrow. She's... Peace out. I have to bring it inside because somebody might steal it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let's see. Here, cable. cable. Comfy blanket. Comfy, comfy, yes. And that's. It actually it's looks cute in here. Yeah. <laughs> Where are you? <laughs> there you are. What? What are you doing? We're about to empty the camera so we can shoot more footage tomorrow. I would say it was a successful day one. Very. Even though we did not have a kayak or, or was fishing able to fish. <laughs> so I'm thinking we'll still try fishing in the morning. Mm -hmm. But the old school way. Yes. Hand hand, hand draw. Yeah. Peace out. Oh no. Out in the wilderness. No excuses. Like I've told you guys. I work from anywhere, <laughs> Literally. even in the freaking forest in a tent. Night, night. Good night. <laughs> oh. Good morning. We're awake. It's freaking cold. <laughs> it is six. 38, my phone is disgustingly dirty. <laughs> 42 degrees. We're ready for coffee. Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit, this is so bright. Shine GoPro, right how do you change the setting of this light? <laughs> okay. Game time. Coming out. <laughs> Hello! Holy fucking shit, it's cold! Very, very, very cold actually. 
The moon is gone. Did someone have a party here? Yeah. It wasn't us, no. that's for sure. <laughs> we don't drink. <laughs> uh, there we go. Now we can turn this horrible light off. <laughs> so much better. As you can see, it's too dark. God. Yeah, <laughs> just sit in the fire. <laughs> it's so cold. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Ooh, this is the the horror story light right here. <laughs> Hello, kids. Have you heard of the the witch Genevieve? There we go. Oh, this feels so good. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's blue still. Look. See that? Mm -hmm. The most important clip of this whole vlog. Coffee making. Did you put coffee in it already? Mm -hmm. Coffee is speaking. <laughs> Put it on the cup. Pizza cracker. It's been great. But it was your time now. Thing that I toss in the fire. Pizza cracker is got sacrificed to the pizza god. Uh, pizza <laughs> pizza cracker got sacrificed to the coffee god. This is the cover. We're the coffee witches. I think that's where we are. Yeah. Sorry, we're just Okay, so uh barista here. What kind of coffee are we having today? I think it's Brazilian instant coffee. Brazilian instant coffee. The finest you can get. It looks so not romantic with this light on. I just wanna it off. Can I not turn it off? What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck is going on? Okay. We I got coffee and we're about to go watch the sunset over here. This is a damn pretty view right here. This is when we take a bath now. <laughs> My dirty yeah. isn't so bad. <laughs> like a hippo. <clears throat> you think it was a hippo? No. That was a we had a strange person. noise. <laughs> it could have been a hippo. <laughs> I've never had a beanie on with my butt. <laughs> <laughs> I mean this one is pretty much dead so.
and just pull his arms up. <laughs> Are we allowed to take these? <laughs> He's Why? like half alive still. Why wouldn't he? <laughs> I need to do the one hand and pick because this is pick that shit. We got another tree today, tree baby, <laughs> just breaking apart the place here. Uh, if you guys want to send your uh, your husband requests, now will be the time. We will turn them all down, but <laughs> you're welcome to try. Hey okay, guys, as you can see, we can survive, so we understand that we're going to get a lot of husband requests. Uh, if you want to send us gifts, you may send them to, I'm going to type, put the address down here. Uh, anything is welcome. Coffee, tents, uh, kayak gear? accessories maybe, uh, adventure gear in general, camera equipment also welcome, and food and snacks. It's a little cold today. We got the fire going here. And as long as we have coffee, we're good. It was actually, it was a little cold in the tent during the night, but I guess on sleep, Genevieve, I think, didn't sleep as much. She heard a dog barking, it didn't bother me at all. Then in the morning, it got real cold, because both of us woke up, or woke up, was awake. And I hear her, she's like, oh, I gotta pee now. I've been needing to pee for like an hour. I was like, me too. <laughs> we're just laying in there, not wanting to go out to pee. We're having a blast though. We had a lot of marshmallows last night in all different variations and forms and combinations. And now I think we're gonna make some oatmeal and go for a little hike. Mm, it's about 42 degrees. That's why we need the fire. My hands are freezing. I'm not gonna lie. Beautiful here. I put the second pair of pants over my first pants and also these are my best warm socks, my transcend socks. They are saving lives. Well, so I talk about this all the time to go check your blood work and food sensitivities and now I have, uh, I'm gonna go do my blood work again. Uh, it's been a few months and Genevieve is gonna go too. She's actually very scared of needles so she's scared of getting her blood drawn so i'm just waiting for her to get her uh, time to go too so we can go together and hold hands and i can support her and cheer her because i want her to be able to get her blood checked too and then she told me yesterday that she has a freaking uh, master in uh, physiology and biology and all sorts of stuff and this is like what she used to do in school she analyzes blood so I have now said that I want to make a vlog of her analyzing my blood or my urine or whatever she wants to analyze. That would be pretty fun. So I'm going to order some stuff online so we can do this because I'm very curious. I, I know a little bit, but I haven't studied anything more than the basic stuff. So this will be exciting. It looks like the sun is coming up over there. Look at that. It's so peaceful and quiet and you just hear some an owl you heard a bird, dog before not anymore some birds and the fish it's breakfast time boiling water for oatmeal and Genevieve here I am not sure I want to know what is on your knee do I want to know <laughs> it's like poop it doesn't smell it's not poop. Okay, it might be chocolate. Chocolate or poop, we're not sure. I want to do a shout out to Nescafe here. 
Classico Brazil is actually very good. Yep. Unfortunately, we were out of South African instant coffee. Oh, damn it. Next time. I'm gonna order. Okay. We're gonna fish with a marshmallow now. It's a fishing rod that does not have a thing on the roof. Because uh, we're doing a anti shout out to Walmart here. Because they sold us incomplete fishing rods. Okay. I'm not gonna be able to record and walk with my coffee, so. Oh, now it's so pretty. Yeah. I just wanted to take a picture. Oh. Well, I got. Okay, show me what we got here. We got a marshmallow. This is a marshmallow. <laughs> this is uh, catfish's favorite meal. There he goes. Watch us actually catch something. Yeah. Oh. Let's see. We have, there's no handle. So it's a thumbnail now. Thumb fishing. She's the definition of a problem solver. <laughs> I really just want to catch a fish. So freaking pretty. See, now there's nothing. Oh my god, it's so dumb. Yes, I mock YouTube videos. <laughs> Is it enough? Yeah, that's what the little bit new. Stole this. I'm not sure what's going on back here. <laughs> Look at that deliciousness. I'm going to do with some cheese, spinach. And probably this. We also have marshmallows left. Do you still sit in there? This is some fucking glamorous breakfast right there. This is a real glamping breakfast. <laughs> what's, what's glamping again you said? Glamorous camping. Can I get a, like a manicure there when I go camping? Probably. Sit to massage? Yep. I like it. Your chains <laughs> up before you get there. We started here with uh, Schöttbullar, but now it's more of a Schött mix maybe? What would you call this in Afrikan? What, the meatballs or... What, what are we making here? This, I would say, we st uh, we made chut bula first, but now it's like a chut mix. It started as frikadella. Frikadella. Oh, we call it that too, but that's a different yeah. kind of uh, way to make it. Yeah. Frikadella. Yes. Frikadella. But that's now what it's, it was. Yeah, and now it's what? No, wow. actually, I would say this is more like frikadella, because in Sweden, frikadella, they're kind of tiny. Yeah, they're small meatballs. Pre yeah, yeah, which is basically what it is now. So now it's fricadale. <laughs> <laughs> and now it's fricadale. The liner video when I take out my teeth aligner with my dirty hands. Okay, as you see, we're real wilderness campers. We do not wash our shit. We just go for it. Actually smells pretty dang amazing. Mm -hmm. I actually don't feel it over here. But... Yeah. Fricadella. And now it's no no more fricadella. Now I don't know what it is. <laughs> now anymore. it's just small flies. <laughs> it's just shut. Oh, next. We're eye food scaling it here. Yeah. Pretty much. You don't give a fuck. Oh, he's fine. <laughs> we dropped him, but he's okay. He's alive. He survived. We just uh, lick our dirty fingers. This is uh, 
If you don't want to catch COVID, this is the best way. Go out in the in the in the wilderness, get dirty as fuck, lick your fingers, and eat off of dirty plates. Oh yeah. Breakfast is served. Mmm. Let's see how this tastes here. I'm pretty sure it's delicious. Mmm. Fantastic. How's yours? How to deflate the mattress, part one. <laughs> Can also make this a a little bit of a <coughs> do like a crisscross. It's it's not really doing much, is it? We're I, there. I think I have to come and push from the back. <laughs> I don't know what's going. But if I push back here, maybe. <laughs> You're just racing up. <laughs> Mattress deflating. Okay. Now I gotta. I, what the fuck? Why is there, how is there still so much? <laughs> I don't know. What is. <laughs> oh my god. This is so much. <laughs> It will go <laughs> eventually. Trying to charge the batteries here in the cars so we can go for a walk. Okay. Help me on time! With a little dash of black coffee. coffee. <laughs> so we want it. Mmm, num num. Yes! We hear you, friend! I'm gonna go get the nut butter. Cause we need the nut butter. Eh. Let me see here. It's nowhere. Stop. Where are you, nut butter? Oh, there. Found. Do you want blueberries in it or no? Just nut butter. There. It's the nut butter. There we go. Nut butter to the rescue. Fantastic. Maybe we should just let it like kind of be for a little. Yeah, I was gonna put the lids on while we walk. Should we put the nut butter in now? Yeah. Oh wait, actually open it. Maybe we can just. How much is in there? I am probably more than we should eat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just because they will just bring it and eat it all. Yeah. <laughs> That's one tablespoon. The camping way. <laughs> One camping tablespoon. That's what it's called. <laughs> Probably too much that we should eat. <laughs> just finish it. Like nothing left. Let's just finish it. Thank you, first four. We've been burning way too many calories out in the woods anyway, so. We're, we're still only on one camping tablespoon. Yes. A camping tablespoon is basically whatever the fuck you put in As there while you're camping. <laughs> whatever you can fit onto a very small spoon, that's... Oh, oh wait. Okay. Thank you so much for this delicious dinner. <laughs> Breakfast. Nut butter, first form. We love you. Go. This is not a bad sacrifice. This is a good one. Goodbye nut butter. It's been... Incredible. It died so fast. Look. That is that's a, that's a good sign. That means the, the nut butter god, he took him immediately. We think the nut butter god heard our prayers. All we wanted was another jar of these, this. So we'll see what happens.
all packed up. We're ready with oatmeal to go for a walk. And then we're gonna go drive back and sit on the couch. <laughs> Let me do that again. We're gonna get back and we're gonna go to the gym. Taste test. Good. Mm -hmm. You know what would make it better? Everything. What would make it better? Cocoa. Oh, yeah. Chocolate chips. We should buy the sugar free chocolate chips. Mm -hmm. I never did. Mm. Mm. Delicious. The oatmeal walk. Like tennis balls, uh -huh. or something, everywhere. Jennifer wanted to be sure, so she got real up close there. <laughs> what sort of poop was it? We have spotted some sort of life. I'm not sure what that is. Never seen this before. What are the white things? Are they animals? Uh, it's hard to say. They're American? Elephants. Elephants. American elephants. We're not sure what it is, so we're gonna stay here, <laughs> hiding in the behind the trees, and try to figure out. It's a cult. Apparently it's a cult. We gotta stay hidden. We brought the wrong shoes. Genevieve the monkey is here. Yeah. There we go. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't camp if you come home without scratches. This is a pull up. There is no proof it didn't happen. <laughs> Be quiet. Somebody took over our camp. Started a fire. They ate all of our food. They took the tent. Oh, Holy God. shit! Oh. <laughs> it was easier than that. I thought it was some like interesting button I had to press, you know. <laughs> Off we go. We had an amazing camping trip. Next time we'll be sure. <laughs> she found water. We had no idea. <laughs> There was even water here. <laughs> Next time we're gonna be sure to check the fishing rods and the kayak inflating device before we go. But now we're gonna go back home, we're gonna eat, we're gonna train, and then we're gonna chill and maybe eat popcorn. We'll see. This has been fun. Next vlog, maybe I'll do a little bit more of an instructional video explaining you know how to make a fire how to uh, cook your food hopefully then we also have functioning fishing rods so we can actually catch our food and i also know that in a very near future we're gonna go deer hunting too that might be a fun one so i'll be back in kansas soon again well i'm not leaving yet but i'll be here for a while more but i'll be also back again after europe 
and the, actually the coffee on the fire was fire <laughs> but i think on the way back now we're gonna go and get like normal society coffee it's also good and the food here on the open fire was bomb if i could i would cook my food on an open fire all the damn time Genevieve, what do you think? Is uh, a soon to come villa going to be deer hunting? Yes. Yes. Stay tuned for that. How to survive in the wilderness. Part one was this. Unpack the car. Go train some, I don't know, maybe shoulders or glutes. I just said we haven't had a mirror in a whole day and it feels pretty good. So I guess. Now we're gonna go in and see, we're like, ah, this is what I look like. Woo. We're back and the nut butter god heard our prayers and we have a brand new jar in the fridge. <laughs> 